So before that, before moving towards what a simple past tense, let us know that what are the tense. Tense now making sutra. What do you mean by tense? Tense is nothing but it shows the time when the action it shows or it indicates the time. Like it? It means that time tamne batave chhe or indicate kare chhe. Now, we come to know that tense means it shows or indicates the time. Now, what is past tense? For main, there are main three types of tenses, mainly non time ka tense which is so they are so you can see over here I have drawn the timeline over here right me a timeline drop you which is this is now that means up a piano venture so that is present tense Over 
there. Right? Now, when in any word, in any word mark, when any word is having a single vowel, see you can see over here a word y ki pan aim bina thi tha to ane aya single vowel chhe leke akha word ma ek aj vowel aave chhe right and that too before this last letter ni pehla j vowel aave chhe to jare aavo hoy at that time aa je letter chhe ne p e again p lakhvano and then you have to write the drop then see pop so here we one vowel and it be last second chhe so i will add e and write e d pop drop pop so i have changes kevi rite thai chhe i hope ke tamne loko ne samjhai chhe now aa je words che apne d ane e d lakhavi ne je words ne kari chhe right these all are known as regular words ene keva words kevai they are known as regular forms so these words are known as jb word ed ane khali word ni pachhad d ane ed lagava thi past form thai jaye chhe such kind of verbs are known as regular forms now there are two kinds of verb regular verb ane irregular verb regular verb we have seen over here right now let's go with irregular verb ke irregular verb kone ke Transfer to past. 
sense the pronunciation change the language. Dig, dug, draw, then drew, drive, drove. Here it is totally changing its form only. It, at, feel, felt, fight, fought, then make, made, put, then it is put, to put a jersey, cut, then the past form but I cut, urge, there is no change. Then afterward, read. In present tense, we read this as read only. But when it is changed to past tense, the spelling the same as this, but its pronunciation will change. And the pronunciation so they just read. In present tense, we spoke it as read, but in past tense, we speak as read. Right? So over here, the difference is of pronunciation. Then afterward, pay, pay. Ride, road, run, then ran, say, say, take, taught, tell, told, think, thought, throw, threw, wake, walk, wear, wore, write, then wrote. So these all are the irregular verbs. Now let us understand this with the help of the I 
ग्लास ऑफ वॉटर द ग्लास ऑफ वॉटर नाउ ड्रॉप ड्रॉप द ड्रॉप्स यस द आंसर इज ड्रॉप बिकॉज ईड इज देर दैट्स वाई देर इज द बिकॉज इट इज द पास टेंस ऑफ यूर ब्रिटन ड्रॉप Now the next is Anu Aunty asked me. Anu Aunty asked me if I blank her. Now the remember remembers or remembered. Yes, because the word is ending with ed, and it is we are solving the exercise of past tense. The answer will be remember, b e r e d. Now the next is by the end of the day. By the end of the day, she had. blank the picture so painted paint or paints yes the answer is painted because it is in the past form and it is ending with ed that's why the answer will be painted so in this way you are supposed to solve the exercise now the next exercise is you have to solve it with the help of irregular verbs this exercise was based on regular verbs now the another exercise is based on irregular verbs Book 
shelf and in the bracket it is written kip so what is the past form of kip it is kept there are no such tricks to remember these irregular verbs irregular ne verb irregular verb ne yaad rakhva mate koi evi trick nahi regular verb ma rules hata ke ed ane d add karva mate there were some kind of rules which i told you but over here in irregular verbs we have to remember these words ke apne logo e aa words ne yaad ch rakhva padse there are no such kind of tricks so the past form of kept is kept i am sure they are kept in they are the books on the bookshelf hmm but it is not there right now so students in this way you are supposed to solve the exercise of the past tense and i hope that you are cleared with the concept of simple past tense very well in the next sessions we will we will try to cover more tenses also in next bija sessions ma apne bija grammar na tenses na jo topics che we will try to cover that part also but today on the basis of this session i will send you the worksheet that you are supposed to solve it in your book and still if you have any doubt regarding that then you will see this video again and your doubts will be cleared by watching the video repeatedly your doubts will get clear okay students so till then bye bye